and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Demir Kraken. I know we've been wanting to play this deck. We want we've been wanting to play Blue Black Control with Ashiok Nightmares Muse. Sorry about the last couple of days. Those y'all on Twitch, or of course those y'all on YouTube. I I was sick. Um, I'm not feeling necessarily the best today still, but I'm I'm basically I'm I'm getting better, you know, and so. We're back at it today. We'll be streaming. I'm not sure if we'll actually get through all four decks. I have four decks up here. We'll just kind of play it by ear and see how far we go. But anyway, this deck, um, you know, I have this listed as a donation deck because that's what it was. But I, I put this one together. It was, it was a challenge to build a Nadir Kraken deck. This new Theros card, 1UU23. Whenever you draw a card, you may pay one. And if you do, you put a plus one, plus one counter on nadir kraken and create a one one blue tentacle creature token that little token you can see there so i was trying to think of like how i wanted to to make a, a kraken deck you know whether blue white blue green blue red blue black you know like basically what color would i want for like the second color because obviously it's a blue card um and did want to go three colors and i didn't really want to go three with it with the mana cost being one blue blue but I kind of settled on blue black because um one i don't think you want to play a lot of sweepers with nadir kraken right because you don't want to like play your creature and then play a sweeper and uh kill your kraken so i wanted a lot of targeted removal um and that's what black has and just a lot of ways to interact with the opponent uh, with black and i also think that you want to play like a long game You're, you don't really want to put this in an aggro deck because you won't have time to pay the one and really get the value from it so you want to play like a real long game with this so each turn or like whenever you draw cards you can keep playing with the one um and so yeah so kind of, uh, kind of settled on blue black for it so we're going to see how it, how it does um i think tyrant scorn is just a pretty good card you know we can bounce our own kraken or uh Tyrant Scorn kills a whole lot of stuff in the format. So we're kind of pairing that, Murderous Rider and e, e to Extinction, kind of pairing those all together. Um, and then, of course, you know, we get to play Ashiok, uh, another new card that I really, really wanted to play. And a card that I think is really good. You know, blue blue and black usually does, can't answer, like, enchantments, for example, can't answer everything. But that minus three is bounce any non-land permanents. You do get to, um, you know, bounce anything. So that gives, gives the deck, like, answers to enchantments. Uh, I'm going to try a Labyrinth in here to remove blockers, and that's kind of about it. Okay, uh, why no Cura best the Sea God? Because it's just too expensive. All right, so let's go ahead and give this a try. So we're going to play, with it being a donation deck, we're going to play through a league. We're going to play until we either win five or lose two, whatever happens first. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, I mean, I think we have, I think that's in the sideboard. Agonizing Remedy or something like that, whatever the name of that card is. Um, I want to keep, you know, like, this is basically a two-lander, but I, I don't think we can. Even though I want to keep. Agonizing Remorse, yeah. I think I have that in the sideboard, if I remember correctly. Yeah, donation decks are $20. Hey, Matthew, thanks for the Twitch Prime resub. Thank you, thank you. Ugh. All right, it's our third sub of the day.
I hope we draw land. Huh. They're obviously going to claim in the Neo form. This. Like the Mexile. Maybe I should have taken Nyssa instead of Cavalier. I hope they don't just play Nyssa. Okay, good. I don't know, yeah, I don't know why Ashiok is super loud. Stop trying to steal my Kraken. It's rude. Um, I'm going to decline. Because we're going to bounce that and play new Ashiok. Um, so, like, basically, like, assuming they're going to play Nyssa and tick up, like, that gets rid of the 3-3. Three, three. I mean, it's not, like, the worst card to draw. It's not... It's not amazing. Sure, I'll, I'll keep it. Hey, Nick. Yeah, I am back. Um, not super hyped about returning to Zendikar. The last Endicar set they did wasn't very good. I didn't necessarily love the first one either. Endicar is like not not really my favorite. It's it's fine though. It's not like I hate it or anything. It's just I wouldn't say I'm super hyped about it. A lot of Nissas. Okay, I'm I'm getting a call from Hawkeye's vet, so I need to I need to take this. Sorry.
Okay, so Hawkeye's going in Thursday, uh, Thursday morning. I'm taking him in. The vet's not in tomorrow, so Thursday morning he's going to go in because <clears throat> hopefully that's good enough. Because, um, yeah, he's, for those of y'all just kind of joining not knowing what's wrong with Hawkeye, he's just, he's really just not eating anymore. And I've tried giving him lots of different types of food and everything, and he is, he is just not, not interested in eating, and so he's losing weight, and yeah. All right, so sorry about that, I'm back. Um, Thought Erasure would be good. But I also want to keep hitting land drops. I think I need to keep hitting la land drops. I think that's more important. I need more lands. No, not at all, Io Deto. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, I'm I'm planning on streaming tomorrow. Hopefully we'll be able to. I mean yeah, yeah, I mean it should be streaming tomorrow. <laughs> Looks like they want to play their threat and have counter spell backup, I guess. Okay, so yeah, so thank you there, Wizard, for the donation deck. This is it's best of one, but build a cyborg for best of three. Okay, cool. Cool. Alright, I'll take a look at that that one tomorrow. Thank you there, Wizard. I probably should have countered the Risen Reef. Here, Wig. Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub. Um, what do I want to do? I think I do want to do that. Hey, Taya. Ah, uh, thank you, wizard. I protect that which cannot protect itself. So I'm one short. Hey, there's Gurr making waffles for the 11th month now. Rise, my elemental friend. Thanks for that Twitch Prime resub. Oh, no. Hmm. Under JJ2. Another brand new Twitch Prime sub. Y'all are awesome. Y'all are getting so much hype in here. I will protect the virtue of this world. It's our fifth or seventh sub of the day? Wow, I'm behind. Seven for seven on the day.
Hmm. It's going to be kind of difficult to win this. So I'm gonna be um No, I'm sorry, no Pit I didn't count it. Um I just count the ones that like while I'm while I'm streaming. <clears throat> so if I I wish I had one more and I could have grown the, the Kraken and been able to exile Omnath and kill Nyssa. If I, if I exile Nyssa, the Omnath is just going to take over, draw on lots of cards. I think that's what we have to do, though. Kraken's looked pretty good, though. Grow Spiral, I guess? Yeah, I guess Grow Spiral... Blows me out. It's gotta be Gross Spiral. Hmm. Or nothing. Just another Omnath? Just be another Omnath if they want to shoot that thing? Okay. That can also be reasonable. Played their land. Did they just play their land before their Omnath? And like play it when the other one was. They had two Omnaths in play, and they played the land at the one time that they're they didn't have an Omnath in play. Hey, Patter. Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub. Welcome, welcome. I don't I don't have anything I can draw that keeps me alive. <clears throat> we might as well just see what our draw step is, but yeah. Be like as long as they're competent and can tap stuff. All right, let's get this disdainful stroke in here. Okay. Let's give this a try. I am back, Kieran. Yeah, I am back. I'm not 100%, but I'm back. It's good to be back. Alright, Kraken. Help me out. Ugh. <sighs> 
the Kraken has looked pretty good in these two games. Alright, so I, I think they have Negate in hand. Yeah, Menomize Prophecy. Um, it, yeah, it would definitely be an option for the deck. I'm not sure exactly where I'd want to fit it in, but yeah, that could be an option. I got two cards over there. I think I probably should just play the Ashiok. I'm playing against Teamer Elementals, yeah. Keep the 1-1 one, one back in case they do have Nyssa. Protect my Ashiok. Yeah, I agree. I think the set is pretty well balanced. It's better... I think it's more so than some of the past sets. Um, just draw three. I'm thinking about just playing Gadwick and drawing three. Yeah, I think I want to do that. Okay. Poor baby is crying. The shadows awaken. So now I can use uh, Gadwick proactively to tap down blockers. Not to brag, but I'm totally okay. These little guys are great. Do I think Labyrinth is better than Blast Zone? I'm not sure. Like they're they're better in different matchups. You know, Blast Zone's better against Witches Oven if there's a whole lot of Witches Oven decks. Um, where Labyrinth is just better against regular old creatures. <clears throat> yep. Wouldn't even need to tap down anything there. That was going to be lethal. So it's kind of nice having, you know, being able to play blue black control, but also having a clock. It's pretty nice. All right, Kraken gets the first one. Um, yeah, I'm. I'm, you know, I'm doing a little bit better as you can tell I'm streaming, but I'm not I'm not feeling perfect yet. Um, but Hawkeye is not he is not doing good. I just talked to the vet a little while ago. He's going to be going in um on Thursday morning because they're not in tomorrow. All right, let's get the second black source. Um, <clears throat> agonizing remorse. 
Aw. I could take my thought erasure, which I was gonna take use a spawn. Just like I'll be right back. I'm just trying to get Hawkeye to eat. Okay. Oh, it's on me? I thought it was on them for some reason. Hey, MV. Thanks for the cheers. Exiling is more important than surveil at the moment. I wouldn't. I wouldn't necessarily agree with that. Um, but that that could that could come up. You know, like that could be a thing. I mean, I I have a couple of remorse in the sideboard as well. Darn. Yay. Always have the backup. Yeah, remorse is remorse is pretty awesome though. It's a really good card. It's I wouldn't necessarily say that Thought Razor is absolutely better. You know, I I think it is pretty close. <clears throat> yeah, it, it is not the it's it's pretty awesome. Bambino, the Twitch Prime sub. Um Hmm So you may cast up to three face-up cards your opponents own from exile without paying their CMC. So I could just cast these three things. We're not going to do that yet. Yeah, I mean, Magic's still just a tough game. Um, so, you're, so you're struggling getting out of gold. Um, and yeah, like, Magic's a really tough game, and you just kind of have to keep playing and, you know, stick with the deck and learn it and... Um, you know, really find your, you know, plans for sideboarding and stuff like that, and just kind of got to stick with it. Uh, let's see. So if we take out Sabotage, that's 61, bringing in just a few more removal spells. Brought an extra Legion's End, extra Cry, and extra, extra Enter the God Eternals. Could be that I want Ritual of Soots instead. Um, I kind of like everything that I got going on here, though. I mean, I could just take out Krakens and play Soots. Kraken's pretty cool, though. Hmm. Maybe I don't play Enter the God Eternal. So 
that too slow? And don't play Thought Erasure. That's probably the answer. Don't play Thought Erasure. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm sure we'll play Grixis decks. I I don't have any plans right now for a Grixis deck. Um, <laughs> I sound better. That's good. Yeah, I'm, I think my cold is is pretty close to being gone. Today it's it's my head is my head's bothering me today. Like I I feel like a little uh, dizzy and kind of have like a headache and stuff like that. I think it's just from keep, like maybe dehydration from medicine and stuff. Even though I was trying to drink lots and lots of water. And it still just happened. What does this deck do versus trawlers? Scrap trawler? Oh, not scrap trawler. Probably dream trawler? Probably dream trawler. Uh, I mean, you just try to make him discard it. Or try to kill it. Because there's a lot of discard and interaction, and everything else, it's it's kind of di it may be difficult for the opponent to keep cards in hand, and so you can kill it. I don't know. Hey, Rex, good to see you. New house hunt going really well. Uh, I found the house that, that, that I'm going to be buying and everything. Um, I'm just kind of waiting on all the, the paperwork and all the, the stuff that goes along with it, but yeah, I know exactly what where I'm going to be living, and I'm pretty excited about it. I guess now I could have could have actually killed the rankle. I didn't want to kill the rankle or where they just sack the rankle and gain some life or draw a card. I'm either discarding Legion's End or Kraken. Discarded another wrinkle. Uh -oh. That's not bad. Let's see. One, two, three, then one. Yeah, might as well keep it. Hey, no carbon required. No, my Kraken. Hmm. We're going to have to discard another Kraken. We gotta kill this thing, obviously.
basically doing that in case we found Temple. Yeah, they, um, yeah, Surveil is, is just for the Ravnica plane, and so that's why there's there's no Surveil, even though that's, that's exactly what the card does, is Surveil. This deck's been pretty sweet. Okay, we're 2-0. Win over Teamer Elementals, then Mono Black. Yeah, Hawkeye, we're 2-0. Correct. The card doesn't trigger surveilled triggered abilities like... Yeah, like disinformation campaign, even though it does. It does surveil, but it doesn't trigger disinformation campaign. Yeah, Krakens look pretty good. We'll keep a Kraken. Boo. Simic Flash, boo. So they got an Essence Capture and a Frilled Mystic. Maybe I should, I probably should have just played the Kraken, but I don't know, getting rid of that, I really like getting rid of that thing that would just keep on drawing them cards. not perfect yet but I am I'm feeling better thank you thank you I may be just a tad bit um, slower than normal. And another brand new Twitch Prime sub. Rap, Valer Rap Valerio. Let's go with that. Thank you, Rap. All right, so that's a sub goal towards our next 12-hour stream. I do owe a 12-hour stream. Also, we have one on the docket whenever I'm feeling well enough for that. Let's see. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, we'll take this.
Drown doesn't do anything. They have one card in their graveyard. So Drown doesn't do anything. Yeah, yeah, I could do 12, yeah, I usually do 12 hour streams on weekends. That's when I usually do them. So Deckmaster doesn't have the new cards yet. It'll take him a little while. Should, should get those somewhat soon. All right, that's a good sign. Good sign this is going to resolve. They have three cards in their graveyard now, as far as Drown in the Lock is concerned. Let's make it four. All right, now it's four. Cricken. Making Crickens. All right, we making Krakens. <sighs> okay, so we have Noxious Grasp, uh, Agonize Your, or let's see, Negate, Disdainful Stroke, Agonize Your Remorse isn't bad. I don't think I really need Thought Distortion. Hmm. A lot of, they had a lot of blue creatures though. I guess Crothacarnarium seemed just fine. Didn't seem bad. It's the Ego Four? I don't know. Ego Dream Dream Trawler. I don't remember. I'm sure I had a plan for the ego. That that card's definitely coming out. Yeah, basically disdainful, negate, remorse, noxious grasp. Those are all pretty decent. It's just like which one is is the best? Do I, I kind of want more discard? I think I want remorse. Give that a try. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, Amor Ego does work well with Ashiok. Casting their stuff. If you're going to minus seven your Ashiok, you're, you can just go search their library first. 
He took six shit is just really versatile, even though it costs four mana, it's just really versatile. He can do everything we want. I don't know, I'm not I'm not sure if mystical dispute is necessary in a deck like this. Could have gone cutthroat first, then dispute, but I guess was worried about one mana removal from me. Let's put one land down at the bottom. All right, more lands out of the deck. I'm not sure why they didn't attack. Um, I kind of think I wanted to say, go, let's go for it. Thanks, corn lover. Yeah, let's go for it. <laughs> Welcome to my With just the you know four cards in hand. All right, well, Ashiok's been awesome. Kraken's been awesome, and yeah, we're three zero. <clears throat> yeah, MV, you just have to keep... Yeah, I mean, you just have to kind of keep at it. Magic's a really tough game. There's a lot of people that don't get out of gold. That's not... That's not something that's, that's unusual. It's not like... You just automatically win if you play kind of thing. I don't really like turn one opt. I want to know more about their deck. What I'm what I'm opting for. Hey, yeah, score, you've been struggling a bit to make abs and hero work. Best of one, it's pretty hard. Yeah, yeah. Abzan, Abzan's a kind of color combination that has a really good sideboard. Um, it's not it's not a very good best of one deck just from a theoretical standpoint um, especially mid-range decks like that that's not usually where you want to be in best of one but anyway be besides that um, I don't I don't have any plans right now to, to play Abzan here. I mean, I'm sure I will. I just don't, I don't really have plans right now. All right, so Simic Ramp again. This opponent seems to be doing a little bit better than our previous opponent was.
<laughs> yeah, release the Kraken. Kraken's pretty sweet. Dude, this Kraken is sweet. Kraken. <laughs> yeah, it's like Demir Aggro. Um, Alright, so we want Disdainful Stroke, Remorse, Grasp. I'm going to cut Cry, cut Enter, cut End. One Scorn. And... Maybe second scorn. Maybe remorse. And scorn's just a good card. Kraken. I can try to say Kraken instead of Kraken, sorry. Um, man, I want to play more Scorns, but I don't... There's nothing here I want to take out of the deck. Could be Drown in the Lock. But I do really like how Drown in the Lock's a counterspell later on. I'll play one Drown, three Scorn. Alright, let's try to find some good cards. Yeah. Yeah, Drown is really good in the late game. Kraken! Boo! Hey, what's up? Calson C. With the Twitch Prime. New Twitch Prime sub, our sub number 12 on the day. Man, I'm still behind. Opponent not letting me crack in. I would not have minded if they used the removal spell there. Or if they used the counter spell on that. Sorry. That's what I meant. Drakir. Also joined in with Twitch Prime Sub. Bunch of new Twitch Prime subs today. Y'all are awesome. Thank you so much. Number 13.
<clears throat> I don't know. I kind of felt like they had another dispute. And so I wanted to wait on that. Man, Ashiok, people just concede to the card. People just concede to that card. All right, so we are four and O. Oh. We're going on to the final boss. Sorry, the ex-ambassadors. Let's go to our final boss playlist. And let's go. Yeah. Yeah, we are finishing these games pretty quick. Especially for a Demir control deck, you know, we're at an hour for four game, four matches. Yeah, my opponent did mold to five. Kraken. Definite keep. Yeah, I'm liking that too. I'm liking how the, the, I guess, Kraken, the Kraken gives us a clock. I like that too. I guess I've just always pronounced this, this word wrong my, in my life. I've always just kind of said Kraken for this, but I guess it's Kraken. Oh, both are correct? Oh, okay. What was that movie? Was it like Pirates of the Caribbean? Is that like the movie where they were like release the Kraken? Or is that was that a different movie? I'm trying to think of like what movie that was. Didn't they say like release the Kraken? Oh, maybe it said Kraken. That was Clash of the Titans. Why is everybody playing Simic? Anybody do anything cool? That was Clash of the Titans. I don't even know if I ever saw that movie. That's a good attack. Thank you. I will block. Line. Exile. Library. Um. Yep. Oh, I'm glad we got that other Risen Reef out of there. For free. Yeah, the Kraken has been really good. Okay, you've been enjoying Selesnya plus one plus one counters. Renata and Growth Chamber Guardian is cool. Plan to build it IRL. Awesome. That's a cool... That's a cool sounding deck right there. Uh, well, I guess we're just going to decline still. How do I want to do this? Is it Gadwick? Draw two or Ashiok? It's Ashiok. I wonder if all your fears are given form.
Hey, Azeroth, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm not perfect yet, but I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this. I think we need like more blockers and everything out here. Maybe our goal is to like mill out the opponent. So I bounce Cavalier of Thorns. Bounce the other Cavalier of Thorns. And I'll probably maybe just kill Risen Reef. Probably want to just kill Risen Reef. Hmm. Or maybe I need to kill Uro. Yeah, yeah, Paladin, you're good. You can, yeah, you can, you can post your deck list in chat. Yeah, you're good. I guess killing Euro doesn't really work because they just bring it back. Yeah, I really should have just killed the Risen Reef the first time. Thanks, Kalsen. So they're down to 23 cards. Please make that attack. Thank you. They just trade a 1 1 for their 3 3 for their breeding pool. Okay, so I'm going to I'm gonna draw two or draw three. I think we'll draw. Draw two and then pump up Kraken one more time or a draw three. I'm gonna draw two. Hey, Penguin Paladin, getting the gifted sub. Thanks, Rogo. Rogo Bop. It's our 14th sub of the day. <clears throat> yeah, Kraken's putting up a some good defense for us. Well, that's going to make things more difficult. So we have 21, 29, 
31, 33, 35 total damage. 35 minus 14 is, I said 35? Yeah, so 35 minus 14 is 21. So we have to have 22 defense. We have uh, 9, 15, 8, uh, 17. Not enough. Okay, so the same sideboarding, we're going to be taking out these cards. Do, do, do. And I guess it's just the two scorns, you know, like I, I feel like I have like 61 that I want to play. Um, I don't think we really need Ego in this matchup, but you could just take, like, Hydroid Crisis. So they don't get to play that card. Something, but I don't think you really need it. Hmm. I wish I had a black source for turn three for Ryder. It's a good hand. Is that just like the perfect curve? Sure looks like it. I'll just get rid of the crisis, try to deal with the other stuff. <laughs> yep, that that's Simic. Every card draw a card. Cannot play Risen Reef and Cavalier of Thorns. Resin Reef. No. <clears throat> so maybe better to, to just counter the uh, Cavalier of Thorns with the Sabotage so they don't get to fill the graveyard for the Uro. Instead of using E to Extinction. They also don't get to. They also don't get to ramp that way. Where's a kraken or an ashiok? Hmm. 
Uh oh. But we know it's not a land. Uh oh. That was a pretty good turn. And then also the Risen Reef hit a land, it didn't hit a spell, so we couldn't just Thought Rager the spell. Yeah, that was a pretty good turn. A new Boros deck with Hactos. That does sound like an interesting deck to play. Something with Hactos. Oh yeah, we lost game one also. This doesn't look good. Well, it's not, it's not a land that they drew. All right, and then they get another Uro. By attacking, I just gain two life, then Resident Reef does one back. So, I, like, I, I net one life. Even though they drew Nissa, Nissa still, like, we're not, we're probably not blocking the 3 3. Like, we, we still netted a life over what we would have had. So, that life could be pretty valuable. Kraken, Gadwick, Ashiok. We need our top end. Haven't found the top end yet. Hey, Tesla. Good afternoon. Looks like we're picking up a loss here. And we're going on to the final boss part two. Opponent drew pretty well. So we are at twelve. I'm gonna draw three. Alright, drown the lock will do. Um Just have one of their mana making things. Things that make double mana. Hmm. 
No, I haven't. I haven't. No, I haven't tried the mono blue yet. I, I don't have anything that takes out two Ceratops in Anissa. We'll just move on. All right, four and one now. Got one more chance at the final boss. All right, this hand looks better. We'll get the Kraken. Don't need Gadwick right now. We don't need more top end. Yeah, it's yep, it's an event. It's the standard tra traditional standard event. I should be casting opt there first before the temple. That's not good sequencing on my part. I can just give him this land though. Go find another land. Um, I'll keep that though. So it all worked out. It worked worked out very well. Double cleave. I will block. So, likely just going to be infuriating. And then we get to destroy and get the two for one. Let's do it. I want to be able to counter the Phoenix. Play Phoenix. All right. Well, I guess I'm countering that now. The land's not a bad draw for me because we get to activate Kraken, Kraken, and Ashiok. Two lands is too little amount of lands for my opponent. It's an unfortunate game for them. So we're going to bring in uh, these things. And we're going to take out... I kind of want to take out Murderous Rider over Eat to Extinction, even though Eat costs another mana because Murderous Rider costs us that life. I'm taking out Thought Erasure. And then one Murderous Rider. Let's do that. Yeah, Demir deck winning the race against Red. I mean, they didn't have very many lands, but... Still not a sight you see very often. Well, 
well, let's draw some spells in the middle. Turn two, turn five. That's all I got. That play's looking kind of dodgy. They didn't have a shock. They did have a shock. Could have shocked their dodger. Didn't do it. Why they played that over Phoenix? I just don't want to play Phoenix. Do they know they have a phoenix? So milling them gives them fuel to get back with the Phoenix. Let's maybe just do this. But then it also fuels up my drown in the lock, but then the, they take the fuel. I don't know, it's kind of weird. That was a good card to draw. That was a good card to draw. So they have three cards in their graveyard. Labyrinth of Skullforce. Um, I guess I'm milling me. I don't want to mill them over more phoenixes. lands all right and that'll do five and one let's get this victory fanfare get that 2100 gold let's go buy a pack to celebrate also because you know obviously still need cards in theros let's do it let's buy a pack what do we get do we get a mythic wow one of the best mythics thassa deep dwelling that's a good that was a great card because we need that for the azorius flicker deck up next i think maybe not maybe we only need three okay no it just had three thassas and i had three thassas so it was the fourth But anyway, yeah, there we go. So there's Demir Kraken. This deck was really sweet. K Nadir Kraken was really good. I liked it. The deck felt really good. You know, we lost one time against Simic Ramp, but we beat Simic stuff two other times. So, you know, just we you know we went two and one against those kind of decks. I guess one was technically Teamer Elementals, and the other two were Simic Ramp. But yeah, I really liked what we had going on here. This, this deck felt really good. Um. Nothing I'd really change going forward with it. You know, I'd have to play some more to really see if there's anything else we need to change with it. Um, but yeah, I liked I liked the list. Um, hey, Cloud, GGs. Um, how many lances has has twenty five? But we also have you know, like the four ops that also can help hit land drops as well. Um, and, you know, temples and, and everything. So, yeah, it, it played pretty well. And then, you know, Thought Erasure kind of helps surveil you for extra lands, too. Would I consider one of the blue sagas? Uh, the seven drop? No, I don't I don't think you need the seven, the seven mana mythic saga. 
as far as like the like the other one like the metamize prophecy or something like that like the two mana one you could maybe have but i don't think it's super necessary um okay but there we go so there we go demir kraken those y'all on youtube i uh, hope y'all are doing good sorry for the two days off um while i was while i wasn't feeling well but um you, those of y'all over there hit that like button leave those comments um you know how's theros going for you what are you playing um what do you think of this demir kraken list if you're playing it also let me know how it's going for you over there but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for the next video.